Hello, my sisters and brothers in Christ. We continue in this season of Easter with great, great joy. And although we just celebrated the powerful movement of Easter Sunday, um, in, in the great wisdom of, of St. John Paul II, he recognized that first Sunday following Easter to be Divine Mercy Sunday. One of the awesome things that we have um, in, our, in our sacristy is each and every day we have the opportunity to look at Jesus uh, in this po portrait from uh, the Divine Mercy, which came from St. Faustina, Kowalska. She was a Polish nun who, in 1931, believe it or not, had these, um, these visions, these interactions and conversations with the Lord. And he spoke to her really about uh, just getting that message out about the powerful mercy of God. Now, we know sometimes we get caught up in the rut of life and like we, we kind of put faith on the side, even though we're right in this Easter season, like we're going to get to it. But it was that reminder of God's powerful love that came forth from Good Friday and was even blessed even more powerful on Easter Sunday, uh, that we are called to get that message evangelizers out there. And this Polish nun, as I said, had these interactions where the Lord uh, gave her that image where Jesus was there and coming from his sacred heart, coming from the wound that was right there, were these two rays, the red and white uh, rays, one showing the righteousness of the souls and also the blood of the souls that were lost. And so, uh, the Lord really challenged and encouraged her to get that message out to others. And so we're doing that right here at St. William the Abbot this upcoming weekend. On Divine Mercy Sunday, we're having a day of prayer uh, following the 12 o'clock Mass from 2 to about 4, 4.30. We'll have um, the, the Franciscan Friars, the Renewal, will come here to offer us this, this powerful, powerful mission experience and speaking into God's divine mercy. So we encourage you to come out. Uh, as I said, we'll have adoration, there'll be some music, uh, there'll be confessions allowed for that, um, and so that we can encounter and experience God's divine mercy and in that beautiful, beautiful sacrament of reconciliation. So make sure you mark that on your calendar as you come to Mass this upcoming weekend, but later on in the day, this Sunday, um, uh, Sunday, April 16th, we'll have the, the chance to be here in prayer. Uh, celebrating Divine Mercy Sunday, the mercy of God's powerful love for each and every one of us. Uh, we'll be able to hear that in, 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 in powerful words, in scriptures, in music, and most importantly, in the Sacrament of Reconciliation. So we'll see you this weekend, Divine Mercy Sunday.